Hi guys, how you doing? Welcome back. We are heading to Mars. Well, we're not heading to Mars yet. I mean, theoretically, we're heading towards Mars. We're about 5% behind the rest of the... Uh, whoops, wrong thing. 5% behind the rest of uh, the world. America leading the way with uh, Russia and China up there with, with them. Basically, everyone's miles ahead of us, and our chances of getting there first are abysmal. So I need to make really good decisions. Everything I need to do needs to sort of assist us in getting... What? What the heck? That's not a good start. Everything I need to do needs to assist us to getting towards Mars. And here we are doing the Mars flyby. Now we're last, very much last. But if we get a decent launch, and we should do, because this is a good rocket, we've had plenty of time to prepare. The Mbababala has blown up on us once. But on the most part, it's a very reliable rocket. And it can reach Mars, which is great. Good conditions, 9%. That's nice. Dwa. De. Un. Holding my breath. That looks good. I think we're successful. Ooh. Only just. Here we go then. Mars flyby. This is in no way going to be easy. So we need thrust. Thrust is most important, which means we need power. So two of those, bit of power. And then we can focus the rest of our time on getting these. So if we can get some barrels. Oh, wow. So for two power, we can get two of these, and that's not good. But for two barrels, we can get three plus some of these. So if I invest a little bit in uh, in power, oh, we're not we're not we're not going to have enough. Well, this is pro problematic, isn't it? Right from the start. So the barrels would give us four or two and two. Kind of need this. So how can I get a barrel? Looks like I can't. Two power for two of these, one power for two of those, two power for two barrels. So this is the cheapest commodity. I think that's the way to go. Oh, look at this, a bonus. Always nice to start with the bonus. So that should give us six of these. Except. Six? How did I get six in my head? Oh, did we spend one? Okay, that's fine. That's all right. So far, pretty good. Bit concerned about this. So we didn't get a bonus one of these at all. That was completely wrong. So, if we spend one barrel and one purple thing, we can get a few bits back. If I spend two barrels, we can get two of those, which means I can get the power that I need. And lots of those. Yeah, I think that's, uh, I think that's, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I think that was a good move, though. I feel reasonably confident. As long as we don't get too much of this stuff going on. That's more like it. 
into the bonus realm. Yes, we do get five this time. So that definitely puts us in a good position. So far this mission is going really well. Last time we didn't even get this far, I don't think. So a Mars flyby definitely going to put a big fat smile on our face if we manage to do it. We've got loads of comms now. Two turns remaining. So I can spend the comms on that quite confidently. Oh, wow, hang on. Whoa, steady, Eddie. Did I do it twice by accident? I think I did. So that's everything we need for that. Um, we are going to come up a little bit short, which means we're going to have to do this again next time. That's not quite so ideal. And... So if I go here, here... Yeah, that's going to leave us... That's actually going to leave us quite short. Um, so we definitely need the power. Because we need the thrust. And if we get lucky, we'll get a bonus on the thrust. And then we might need to do thrust for the next level. Um, but how am I going to get this boosted up? Because the best way to boost it up is with barrels. But barrels are... Frustratingly expensive. So I can ditch all our power and go that way. But then still... still think we're going to struggle really badly. In fact, I didn't need the comms at all, did I? So the comms haven't really worked in our favour a great deal here. So this way we get to keep our power. And the mission is completed, but we'll need five in the next mission. It's a big ask. I I think it's beyond us, actually. I think I've already put this 50% uh, bonus out of our reach. And even if we get a bonus, uh, I don't think it's going to be enough, because we still need to buy four of these, which is very frustrating. That doesn't help a great deal. So I could have done without that. I really need to think, uh, get it clear in my head exactly what's coming back on each mission, on each command, sorry, so that I can gauge whether or not it's worth investing that extra, extra energy into it. So we're going to have to buy this, otherwise we don't have enough of that. And then I need four of these. Well, I've got two barrels, so that puts us perilously close. And we have two power. Or, so nearly clicked on the wrong thing there. We can go over the top with this and guarantee this, and we've got two power spare. I think that's the way forward, guys. I think that's the winning combination right there. In fact, I could have done that the other way round, because we didn't need 15 of these, did we? Could have been smarter about that. Yes, I could. So this will give us nine navigation points. So it all comes down to this, and we've got two power left over, and look at that. Ah, oh, it's gone so well. <sighs> I probably made it sound a lot harder than it actually was, I think. Control burn successfully completed. Mission is 100% completed. It's only phase one of three, of course. A long way to go, but it's a bloody good start. We're on our way to Mars. Look at all the asteroids and debris and space trash flying around. I'd still like to do the moon landing. Who the hell is this? Oh, that's us. Hey, hey, hey. Next mission phase is ready. Mars flyby is ready for its next mission phase. Go to the active missions. Hey, are we going to be first to do this? I don't see any... Ah, God, no. 
No, 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 no. Everybody's already done it. Been there, done that. Bought the t-shirt. Got some souvenirs, left a flag on Mars. Yes, they've done all of that. We are miles behind. <sighs> but we can catch them. I'm like a turtle. Scientific data. That looks really quite easy. Right, so barrels are the priority here. So for power, I can get two barrels. For one power and one comms, I can get four nav, and then nav gets me barrels. That's not a bad trade-off. So for one barrel, uh, for one power, I can get two barrels. And then I can get extra everything here. I like that. Let's go with it. That's rather less thought out and more instinctive. But I think it's going to work. So that's that part of the mission completed. Oh, well, the telemetry transfer never goes well, does it? Yes, we'll pay. We'll pay to get our power. Thank you. It's quite important to us that we have it. That's two parts of the mission completed already. That's quite a good start. We are lacking in barrels, however. Um, this obviously being the most important thing is a bit of a concern so i can trade this for four of those and then trade one of those for some barrels in fact i could do that twice and with three turns left I, I think that puts us in a pretty strong position two power left on the board still flyover course adjustment is good Atmospheric sampling is very good. I don't think you can get 100%, can you? 99% is the highest I think I've ever seen. Right. So that's pretty much the mission completed right there. Two turns left. Atmospheric sampling a success. So we got two turns, we could complete it here right now, couldn't we? So if I trade up one of those... Then we've got eight, four. Trade up a barrel. We've got the four we need, we've got the five we need, and we've got seven on the barrels. So if I just buy some barrels, we've got one power to last us over. Oh, look at this, we get a bonus. Would you believe this? This might be the last Mars flyby that the world has ever seen, but it's going to be the best. Oh, another bonus? Really? Do I deserve another bonus? Are you sure? Oh, all right then. All right then. We'll take an extra bonus. Why not? Magnificent. Look at that. These people get to go home early. Everyone gets a bonus. Milestone achieved, the Mars flyby. We were fifth. I mean, we were fifth. We were fifth. But that helps our experience, which is great. I don't quite know how to get this up yet. Probably going to have to investigate that a smidge. Okay, so what active missions do we have? We have no active missions whatsoever. I'd like to land on the moon. I really would. And I know that's going against our, our Vesta payload, but I think landing on the moon is something A, we all want to see, and B, we all want to see it. Mars is dead. A popular magazine has declared that Mars is dead. After your recent Mars flyby mission dashed any far-fetched hopes that the planet had 
artificial canals, the article questions the worth in going back to such a barren world. Your scientists have urged committing the agency to a Mars orbit mission to prove how much there is yet to discover. Let's do it. Your agency has pledged to send a satellite to orbit Mars. We've only scratched the surface of the red planet so far, a spokesperson said. It has countless mysteries yet to uncover and we plan on uncovering them. Any negative reaction to the magazine's article seems to have been prevented, yet it remains to be seen if the public will be won over by the mission. Alrighty, let's do that then. Let's go for an orbit. I need to do that research as well. A little frustrating. I think landing on the moon has to be our next priority though. Definitely going to get a bonus here, right? Yes. It's much harder to get uh, any additional cash coming in in latter years. So America appears to have done a Mars orbit. Placing a satellite in orbit around Mars would enable comprehensive atmospheric analysis and image collection. The next step towards mapping the mysteries of the red planet. Let's get on and do that. So we need to have done a crewed mission landing before uh, we actually attempt to fly on the moon, right? Oh my gosh. I think we've put ourselves in an endless loop there. The crewed moon landing situation. Mars orbit. Why didn't I plan this? That was foolish. I've wasted a lot of time there. Okay, well I want this to be successful, so we're going to pay the extra, and we're going to stay positive, even though I just completely screwed up. Months and months of potential development time. Zero on the budget review, which is not surprising, because I skipped an entire year without doing anything. That was very foolish. But here we have our Mars orbit payload, and it looks fantastic, look at that. 10% launch reliability decrease. That's not what we were looking for at all. So we've got Thor. Now Thor. 75% reliability, but... I've got a sneaky suspicion that Thor has been slightly explosive in recent launches. Engineer available and experienced propulsion systems engineers become available. Hiring them for your agency would boost that and launch reliability for the Mars orbit mission higher. Brilliant. We're up to 85% now. There she is. Launch preparations. 100%. Oh, maximum mission training bonus increased by 100%. Okay, set training on that because the launch is about as good as it could possibly get. So May is the earliest we could do it. That's such a long way away. Let's go August. So we could be second to do this. They're going in April. All right, let's race them to it. Let's go in April. And we'll leave at two o'clock in the morning. And hopefully we'll beat them there. Crude moon landing research complete. One giant leap for mankind. The, third, the first astronaut to set foot upon another planet represents a monumental triumph of human ingenuity and daring. Those who achieve it will be immortalised by Earth's astounded populace. And it's not going to be us. Because it's already happened for loads of people. Let's get back on Vesta. Let's focus our attention where it needs to be. But let's prepare. What are we missing? Apollo? We need Apollo. Damn it. We need Apollo. 
before we can go to the moon. Nothing has happened. That's like two or three years where we've done absolutely nothing. Here we go, the Mars orbit. We can't be last. 99%, look at that. So if we launch, if the launch goes well, then it should be uh, plain sailing. Conditions look pretty good, actually. Come on, Thor. There's a huge amount riding on you here. Oh, that hasn't helped. Mm. Please take off nicely. Be a good little rocket. That looks nice and straight. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Wunderbar. Come on, be positive. Ooh, why would you do that? Minus one power for the duration of the mission. Ouch. And this is, uh, this is the maximum it could possibly be. Uh, if only China weren't pushing us to go early. Six of those and four thrust. Okay. So we should be able to get four thrust in one easy maneuver. That's good. So we can get lots of power. So if I spend three on that, and then use that for power, I can get four back, but we need thrust. Ah! We need thrust. That's paramount. Okay, that's a good start. Oh, look at this. Look at this, though. 99% successful. I mean, it's possible something could go wrong, but it's not going to go wrong, is it? We, we've already got a bonus. We're very close to getting two bonuses in a row. I think we did a great job here. Thrust burners, very low. Ordinarily, that would be a problem, but not today. Today, that is absolutely fine. So that's nearly the mission complete already. All right. Hang on, what did I do last time? Because what I did last time was good. Uh... did I do last time? Ah, so I spent three to get six power. That doesn't give me enough barrels. Is that a problem though? Perhaps that isn't a problem, because we need to get 12 and 8. I think it might be a little bit of a problem, mightn't it? Two barrels and some power. That's what we need to achieve that. Okay, we've still got quite a way to go. We've got we still got like another three command turns, so 
The most difficult thing is to get enough navigation, and this will put us really close, so uh, I think that makes sense. It's very possible that there's a better way of doing what I'm doing right now, but this is the safe route. Having said that, a better way of doing it would also be safe, because it would be better, but uh, unless you see it, you can't do it. Is the problem? Not really a problem, just the reality. Look at that. So we've got all the comms and barrels that we could possibly need. So that's for free. That's for free. Oh, I'm a barrel short. Okay, that could... That could be okay. Considering how many bonuses we've had and how easy this looked from the start, I think I'm making a real pig's ear of it. I still think we'll get the 50% bonus, but I think we'll be dragging our feet over the line at the end. Look at all these points. I don't need that many, surely. Manual thrust adjustment completed. So that puts us within four, and that puts us within three. And we have two barrels and six comms. So theoretically, that should do it. We still got five power left. What should we spend it on? Don't really need to spend it on anything. You currently have unused command slots. Do you still want to continue? Yes, because what happens? Do I get an extra power? What happens? Oh, look. Doesn't even affect us when we get 9% satisfaction. Mission complete. Thank you, everybody. You have been amazing. It's only phase one, of course. So, guys, I think we'll wrap it up there for this episode. It's quite a long one. A lot of stuff has happened. A lot of good things have happened. Next mission phase is ready. So join me again in the next episode, and we'll take that on. Thank you for watching. Take care of yourselves. Till next time. Goodbye, guys. Goodbye for now.